MSNBC Republican host, Second Amendment men to fight foreign militias. You would think that, as a Republican, Nicole Wallace could easily explain the need for the Second Amendment. But, as host of her own TV show on MSNBC, she isn't about to save her soul from evil by telling the truth. She has to blur the lines, especially with a movie star opposite the table who knows nothing about the reason our founding fathers gave us the right to bear arms. Here's what Wallace said, via Mediate. It seems like with this debate we careen from tragedy to tragedy and nothing ever changes. How do you guys stay in the fight? You know, I mentioned to you too that a conservative wrote a piece last week that got a lot of attention about maybe opening up the conversation about the Second Amendment, his name's Brett Stevens, and he said the intellectually honest way to have this debate is to say that this isn't what was intended, that we are an armed population. This was a right to bear arms against foreign militias. America's founders disagree with that assessment. They left quite a paper trail showing exactly what they intended with the Second Amendment. I realize many of you might think Wallace is ignorant or incapable of articulating a truly sound reason for the Second Amendment, especially for someone who claims to be a member of the GOP. I think she knows perfectly well why the right to bear arms is in the Constitution. Her inarticulate reasoning was done on purpose. She wanted people to question the basis of the Second Amendment, so that it would be easier to dismiss it. It is a clever straw man argument by leftist doublespeak artists to leave the listener with the only logical conclusion. The Second Amendment is antiquated and superfluous. And it works for the uninformed and the already adamant hardline anti-gun tribe. Never think these leftist progressives pundits don't know what they are saying or doing. You will only be doing so at your own ignorance and peril. And, consequently, their success. There's a copy of the Constitution with commentary on court cases and views pursuant to the law called the Citizen's Constitution by Seth Lipsky. It dispels with a lot of the junk you hear on TV about the Second Amendment. If you feel Wallace purposely tried to mislead the public, share this on your Facebook. Twitter timeline and alert your viewers to her plan and how we caught her in the act. Also leave your opinions below in the conversation section, section.